put his mark down. Now, one final Evo former champion remaining in his path before he can face Momochi in a potential grand final. Oh, are we gonna get the character dance? No, Infiltration says, I don't care if you pick Elena. My character, I feel I can counter both of them. And I believe this was the result of a blind pick. Oh, okay, so Infiltration okay. able to use his deep character knowledge to get Gamer B to overcommit to Elena. And Chun-Li is considered amongst the metagame masters to be a good counter, or at least a solid fight against Elena. Yes, yeah, Chun-Li, one of the key things is she has really great buttons, great range yes. that can fight Elena's buttons. You don't have to dash into range of Elena's oppressive crouching right. shorts. And honestly, Infiltration can probably be considered one of Gamer B's demons as well. Like I said, he's the man sure, who robbed him, him of the pile. Yeah, yeah, sure. He's the man who robbed it, uh, Gamer B of his EVO championship of second place finish that one year. On the way to the top of the top, everyone's a demon, man. They must all be slain. One by one, giants must fall. And the fireball, of course, something else we should acknowledge as an important element of this offense. Elena. Oh, wow. there it is. Just focusing the it focus up. Back just back like that. yeah, that's the trick. We could be in for a long haul here. This game keeps up like that. Nice EX reversal. Okay, good clean. Clean punish there by Gamer B. Oh, love the stand roundhouse. Owning that space, saying, no, you can't just walk in here. Yeah, you can see why this pick is working out so well for infiltration so far. Gamer B really just playing very defensively, trying to play this healing oh, game, solid punish, and it's just not working. Yeah, that is that is his sort of idea about how to counter this, is just to really focus up the fireballs. Now realizing it's not going to pay off, he's got to come Ooh, in. Oh, counter poke, but too far that time. Not able to complete the combo. Running away, surprisingly close, given the dominance of infiltration overall in terms of calling the tune in this match. Oh, finds the slide opening, but backdash is the way to safety. And he doesn't want to throw the fireballs from there, oh, but he still gets caught. Him. And after all that work from infiltration, third healing from Gamer B gets him to a point where he has a life lead with 10 seconds left to go. No, that's punishable. Yeah, he, he tried Big to frame trap. Yeah. yeah, he tried to frame trap with those follow-ups. And Gamer B did not bite. So after that dominant beginning, it was Gamer B who weathered the storm, healed up, found his opening. A Gamer B of years past would have cracked yes. in that situation. Absolutely. absolutely. And been mad at himself. And, yeah. Right, exactly. Not this man. This is a new man. Is he the final form that can finally allow Gamer B to reach the pinnacle? Holding the distance. Anything outside of low roundhouse range, you can throw fireballs. Oh, he knew he was going to get hit. He didn't even cancel no. it. He just let it rock. Because he knew it wasn't going to be a huge hit. And look at this. What he did there was create a scramble situation and was able to come out the better of it. And now with a huge Ooh. life lead over Chun-Li, who has no healing. Get over there, out of the corner. Infiltration must now consider finding a way to get in. Plenty of time on the clock for infiltration, though. No reason for him to rush into this at all. He can still do this very patiently. One EX legs into Ultra 2 will be in, won't give him the life lead, but it'll be enough to put the nerves on, to put the pressure but on the Gamer here is, Yeah, he's given the healing again. He must hold back to charge the fireball, but to approach, he must move forward, and he does not want to get into the range of Elena's low shorts. There it is, he's trying to counter poke from that other secondary range at which Chun-Li can dominate Elena, but Gamer B showing himself to be a master of the meta strategy in this particular matchup. Content to sit back and heal it up. Now time running out on Gamer B. Does not want to go down 1-0, and that could Ooh, be oh, a punish the, possibility. The hurt box, the hurt boxes of Elena may have saved Gamer B right there. That had picked him up, yeah. Elena with a very unusual hurt box. That punish did not pick her up to lead to any kind of substantial damage as the time ran out on Gamer B's comeback attempt. And this has got to hurt. He made the smart call on the select screen, was right. able to find the perfect counter character, but Gamer B's match knowledge just proving too strong, saying I will not lose to a bunch of fireballs and just keeping me out and being outpoked on the ground. Throw all the fireballs you want. I'll focus them up. I'm just drinking those fireballs. They're powering up my healing. I know you don't have punishes from range against my healing. 
Would we consider a possible use of Ultra 1 to try and punish the healing? I, I would imagine a, a character change at this point. It could be, it could be. But Chun-Li is the counter. Look, during some of the other games earlier in EVO, uh, I said this on the social media, Look, you do not know the kind of pressure, the kind of stress that being on the stage, grand stage, like... It's until, stressful for anybody. Until you're up there, you just can't no, know you can't how much pressure this is. You can see it on their faces right now. It only comes once a year. You don't have too many chances to experience this kind of pressure. But also, this would be tough for anybody. But what makes these guys champions, they have poured hundreds, thousands of hours into this game thinking about it, talking about it, analyzing, trying to do the absolute best they possibly can. So they literally have a huge investment, personally, emotionally, in some cases financially, into succeeding at this game. And now, Gamer B showing a slightly different side, willing to try and go in, right. smelling that infiltration will not go to the all-fireball offense. So adjustment on adjustment on adjustment. And now Infiltration says, I would really like to play this fireball game, but he knows he has to mix it up just a little bit. Going for the healing, knows he doesn't have the charge. Wow, he gets the full one and does not cancel it. And Infiltration was expecting it. That's why he made sure Den did the full jump in combo so he could get as much damage as he could. But still barely came even. And that's the thing, it cannot be canceled once she reaches into that sort of celebratory final animation. Another ultra just like that. Out of range. The work Infiltration must do just to keep up with this character. And again, Gamer B is not looking just for a fireball, but a slow fireball that'll evaporate in time. Going low, smart stuff. You always have to represent that low, otherwise the EX Mallet Smash is essentially useless. Yes. It has to be a surprise. But once again, Gamer B, matches. you see, he has the healing again. So he keeps backdashing and baiting Infiltration to try to commit to something. Wow, he's just going right in. That is, the, that is the best punch you can get from that range in terms of fast move, in terms of moves that have range. Oh, now this time Chen Li's hurt box saving her. Yeah. Time Fourteen running seconds. low, but also another healing potentially on the table. Oh, oh he, he finds the knockdown. Oh, oh the he gets it. Is he gonna steal it away again with the healing? Yes, here it comes. Healing, the back dash. One second. And, oh my god, that's gonna do it. That's, wow. That is exactly what he wow. needed. Got just enough health back. Wow, and the, what what a gut punch for infiltration. The demoralizer. Round. It really is the demoralizer. Wow, that hurts so bad. Catches him there, now good corner pressure. He knows he's gonna have to switch it up, and this is his choice. He's going hard at Elena, finds the scratch wheel. Yeah, I think Infiltration's realized now that this fireball game is not gonna work for him. He's gotta go in, he's gotta play the offense. Okay. Now, here comes Gamer B. He's able to get just even after that incredible run. Okay, nice. Popping good him out of the air. Good yeah. anti -air. All right. Yeah. So this is a big enough there right lead yeah. that Infiltration can now play a defensive game and get Gamer B in there. But he has, to, he has to realize that his defensive game cannot consist of fireballs. Yes. Because that is just going into focus. And yeah, he's trying to bait him into it with those EXs to focus back down. Oh no, a little bit too hard on the offense. Gamer B had the same read. He said, you know what? He's coming in on me. So now I'm going to counter with my pokes. Beautiful back and forth here. Oh, he stood up. Oh, he wow. stood up. Oh, but Just Gamer like this. They're taking the offense right to one another. It's going to give him a lot of ultra, but put him back in the match. Can you shut down that? He would have liked to throw a fireball there, but knows better in this situation. He knew better. Yeah, but Gamer B still the life lead, yeah, and he still has that healing locked and ready to go. And there is how he baited it with that back, with the EX fireball, was able to get some extra damage. And here oh, we go, no. activates it. Is he going to cancel it? No, he just wow. looked back, and only a sweet punish. The mind games. Yeah, Infiltration didn't believe he was going to let it go no. that whole way as well. Gamer B is in his head with that healing. And James, you asked me before earlier, is this man a demon? I would say yes. yes. He's unkillable. Maybe Gamer B has become everything he fought against. The biggest demon yes. of them all. With this vicious healing strategy. And again, he's built up the healing. He can just let it rock again, which is... Oh, and no, the the crowd is shot. oh no, he had the opportunity. Great Trying to make it happen. There Time running out, another healing. Just gonna let it rock. Shameless. Again. 
Shameless with the healing. And a back throw from Infiltration. Oh, again. Okay. That's a, he got him back in the corner. This is really key Even for him. Life. Time running out. 10 seconds. Oh, too, oh, far. too far. Too far. Good luck. Can Infiltration run away? No meter for Elena. This is the key. That was, that was Infiltration gutsy. gets to stand fierce. Anti-air. Jeez Louise. He is being pushed to the absolute limit here in terms of what he can take. How many times, how many life bars worth of damage does Infiltration have to deal to defeat Gamer B? Gamer B, such a good guy, such a nice guy. No one's nice on the Hard, to, hard to pull for him in this one. Yeah, this is, uh, he is really sticking it to him with some genius understanding. Using the low fierce, which advances slightly to get underneath that neutral jump from Elena. Very smart stuff. And to be honest with you, this is 1-1 one, one right now. I swear this feels like it's 5-5 five, five already. And it feels like, yeah, this is a best of uh, best of nine set or something. We are going to the limit in terms of time. We're going to the limit in terms of how much damage can be possibly dealt. Infiltration standing strong, but how many mental resources is this going to take to see as we decide which one of these men will move on to face Momochi in Grand Finals? There it is again. Infiltration with a pretty solid punish, not letting Gamer B come all the way back into it. Oh. Infiltration switching it up here now. Oh no, that's going back to that healing and chasing him down. Solid punish. Yeah, the slight. Oh, oh! That just went right through somehow. But not a huge punish. The scratch wheel has some key properties in Hazanshu. As well. Oh, oh, face it out. Oh, oh but, but a little far. too far. And Infiltration's gonna get the punish here. Huge life lead gets him with the overhead. Did not have Ultra there to follow up those EX legs. Oh, he gets him. Just so like he's this. Gonna he's gonna get a safe back. Ultra. He's gonna get a safe it's healing. Gonna be even. No. He can take a few more hits now. Watch out for that EX. Mallet smash once again. He will not be able to heal oh, all the to survive is. this. And denying that neutral game. So Infiltration somehow finding. The internal will. fortitude, the will, the absolute will. To say this guy is going to be healing 50, 60, 80% of his health bar back over the course of these rounds. That I have found the right mix. I have to find the right formula of offense, of defense, of fireballs, of going in to crack this case. Yeah, all he's saying is that just means I have to kill you twice around. I'm yes. fine with that. I have no problem with it. Do your thing, Gamer B. I've got it covered. Gets hit out of the air there. Nice situation. Ooh, very fortunate wow. trade. Gamer B not willing to be put on his heels. Wakes up the scratch wheel. Bold stuff. Oh, not a punish. Fail punish. Try the frame trap again, as you talked about. Oh, not expecting that wake up. But again, the healing already going wow. with punish. What a counter and punch. Ultra two. Two. It's not going to be enough. And now the healing fully stocked. And he's going right at it. And only a stand strong wow. punish. And he has the life lead now with that. Oh, good timing on that punish. Like we said, odd block stun catches a lot of people off guard. And who is this sorry character, Chun Li, that gets only one ultra per round? Like, that's not, yeah. It's ridiculous. <laughs> oh, that's it. Oh, oh no. no! Oh, no! He got the last minute. He gave and he goes for a simple combo. Another mental break. This is, again, the pressure we talked about. The fact that he's having to kill this character. Two, three times to get the job done. It is so mentally draining to have to kill this character that many times. And he crouched just a little too early, maybe switched his mind about what he was going to do in terms yeah. of anti-air at the last minute and paid the ultimate price. And that also is a benefit of that really odd jump timing from it Elena. Yeah. Sometimes you don't have reactions can help you in those situations, but if you do react and timing, it's just going to whiff under her. Yeah. And again, smelling that jab fireball oh, and evaporate. no punish at all. And Elena is ahead, just like that. And now with that combo, she's ahead by a lot. Oh, great, with punish again. Here comes infiltration. Hazanshu a little too far, though, to come combo after the Hazanshu. Gamer B wisely just doing nothing. He knows infiltration doesn't want to overcommit. Says I can just chill back here and block. And his block cross screen threat is basically that healing again, the demoralizer. Wow, huge damage, and look at this. Look at that. What do you do? Infiltration as we speak, the meta, the established meta of which character beats which character may be changing as we watch. 
Oh, and then just a crouching jab to finish it off. And you see Gamer be there with a sigh of relief nod. Does He's infiltration wet. have the gas in his tank to survive yeah. this? This is really key because that second game, that meta changed. Like you said, infiltration started in getting it. And that's why Gamer B let out that sigh right there because he said, you know what? I weathered that storm. I solved that problem. And now I am back in control. I am back in the driver's seat. And infiltration has to think about what character to pick again. I think you're absolutely right. These games are, we've talked about speed chess. We've talked about poker. In this sense, also a puzzle box, uh, an active, dynamic, action-filled puzzle box. Yes. And we are seeing solutions on solutions. Infiltration had basically decided, he accepted the established meta. Right. Chun-Li beats Elena. I have a great Chun-Li. I'm going to play this match. Use the blind pick option, which is, again, where you tell a judge which character you're going to choose, and then the opponent picks first, and the judge enforces that you chose the choice that you told them. So a bit of metagame happening there. He made the right metagame call. And Gamer B, with a relentless, I think, dare say shameless, uh, approach to just hanging <laughs> back and using that ultra option he has. Again, the way he's doing it is the focus allows him to absorb the fireball, and that still powers up his ultra meter. Right. And he's able to just sort of fight from across the screen by not fighting at all. Uh, infiltration. Recent times, he's been using a lot of DiCaprio. You see him hovering, he's thinking about this. There must be something about this match that he doesn't like to will, be this hesitant. I will tell you honestly, like, infiltration, or excuse me, DiCaprio is all about what? Oh, oh. What? What, what? Double what? I'm we, out we've of seen what, him use it. We've Literally, seen him use Relento. Literally, stick and it would be yeah. anywhere. He's used Relento against Snake Eyes at Texas Showdown. That's we true. We know he That's has a Relento, call. but against Elena, is that necessarily a great call? To me, the DiCaprio, what I was gonna, the point I was gonna make about DiCaprio and why I didn't like it was the jabs. Like, what DiCaprio is excellent at is getting up close, getting in your face, but ironically, Elena can just sort of hold back and hit the jabs into big damage, potentially. What? This guy, you're not allowed to have a good time. He is. You're just put on your butt. That is. some incredible choices. <laughs> he knows, infiltration's <laughs> mind has been fried. Both of these guys willing to take a break, acknowledge, what incredible players they are, the crowd feeling it. I gotta give it up as well. Evolution 2015 Ultra Street Fighter 4 action. Gamer B infiltration Get taking hyped. it not only to the max here in battle, but outside of battle as well. It's a hype select screen. Okay, now they're going back to the water bottles. Everybody, this, this is Street Fighter you cannot miss. What will be the choice? Some oh. metagame hype right here. Tell everybody, gotta watch this. The clock has been called. The judges have called the clock on him. Tweet it out. 60 seconds on the clock. Get everyone to watch this. This is amazing stuff. And we are gonna have someone holding a clock on them. And Game Review is just laughing about it. Tony like, Cannon has approached the stage and officially called time on infiltration. He must make a choice. He is not allowed to linger at the screen for an indefinite period of time. The opponent can call time, a judge can also call time. And that is what has happened. Whoa! What? We thought we saw the last of Jury when I.I. was eliminated. Just when you think infiltration is out of surprise. What, what? Switching his buttons? Interesting, okay, this is, okay. Uh, okay, three right. kick and three punch button switch. Wow. Wow, just when you think the man with the infinite bag of characters is out of surprises. He's thrilled us in EVO Finals before with surprise choices. Here he is again. Nobody saw this coming. May the spirit of I.I. be with him. Gamer B, of course, feels almost destined to reach this pinnacle. Can he be stopped? Here we go. Jury versus Elena to determine who goes the grand finals. Now here's the question. Is this same kind of meta we saw with Chun-Li going to be possible with Jury? No, Jury gets a little bit, she has a slower startup on the fireball, but a faster follow-up, and I think that may be the bet that Infiltration is making. And that might, it might be just that simple. When the fireball comes out, he knows he can follow it in for much Ooh, bigger damage. Gamer be dropping his combo, but then Infiltration not getting his cancel on the punish. Here we go. Oh, here's the, here's the, the yeah, yeah. 
But you know what? Jury can do probably a little more damage. A little more damage and, and a better, fo faster follow-up. Right, and no meter spent to get that damage. I love this slide from Gamer B back there, smelling neutral jump and finding a way to slide it out of the air. Oh, wow, trying to the counter, counter out of there. Another healing happen. in your face. Oh. Shutting it down, but now an even match, and here comes the Feng Shui. The problem with landing that die kick, though, that might have reminded Gamer B if Infiltration has a meter, he gets uh, a, an EX dive kick from far. And Gamer B very happy to spend that meter there, even though he was blocking, just to try and grind out the Feng Shui engine to remove the timer on that, take that advantage oh, away. Oh, and a punish on the overhead, the whiffed overhead. Gamer B is playing this masterful footsies game with those pokes. And Another Gamer B Feng says, Shui. you know what? I've got my own unorthodox ultra, but Gamer B not letting him get any play off of that Feng Shui engine. And now Gamer B at match point. You can tell, you can see the, the essence of Infiltration's game plan here with Jury. And it is a good idea, but does he have the execution to beat a player like Gamer B? Character is an absolute master of the Elena match. Oh, he uses wow. the counter to get out of the corner. Again, a big risk but it is just not working. This is not working out for infiltration at all. Gamer B is making all the right decisions. Ooh, trying to chase him down. And I like that he's not trying to get back. He's trying to threaten at all times, stay just at that range. Wow. Oh, beautiful block. This may be his last chance. Yes. Thanks, Wayne, he's can, powering up. He's he can, gotta get it done. He can make all that life bleed away, just like that. Just Those like this. Wow. Here we go. Oh, the, reset. Up with the reset in the middle. Comes down to this. And oh, it is. Infiltration is here to play. Stay is alive. Play. Just like I said, that Feng Shui engine, Feng Shui engine. Just, it's so much potential for damage if you pull out those resets. And what may be one of the longest matches in Street Fighter history in terms of clock time. He is going the absolute distance. Must win this round in order to take it to the final game. And now he's got Gamer B dancing to his tune, trying to come in and find a way through the fireballs. Oh, he switches Ooh, it up with a dive kick. I like it. Yeah, I'm surprised. Where's the focus back dashes that we saw from Gamer B before to get the healing? And he's not doing it at all. This match is coming down to as simple as, like, who is mentally in control? Who, you know, if Elena can make Juri come to her, Oh, he oh off. Okay, big, big stun punish. here. He's going to heal after this. Yeah. Get someone's life back, and just like that, oh, tight in life. Very conservative, though, showing a lot of respect for Juri. Watch out for EX Mount Smash. That was he, what he was trying yeah. to, you know, show. But oh. uh, Infiltration did not bite. Oh, here it wow. comes again. But That's a position challenge. Wow, he knew he could do it. Oh. Great dash forward. Good challenge into the reset. Could it be enough? And the throw! Yes. Infiltration lives on! We are going to the final game. The final game. When Two great champions. When everything looked like it was going Gamer B's way, suddenly it has turned around. And How many times can this happen in one set where it looks just completely hopeless for the other man? And then he swings back. Infiltration gave me a little back rub like, sorry, dude, I know this is completely... Meanwhile, <laughs> in the offing, we've got Momochi basically uh, cackling, yes. knowing that these two his two potential opponents are being completely drained of their life yes. force by this grueling match. I'm almost positive that Infiltration leaned over to Gamer B and said, boy, this sucks. <laughs> <laughs> Gamer B looks like he is going to make his decision here to go to with Adon. If he chooses Ultra 1, he can easily react to a lot of the, uh, the fireballs, the Fuhajin releases, That's and true. counter with Ultra 1. Yeah. Infiltration, his die is already cast. He's not able to switch characters. You're only eligible to switch characters when you have lost. So it'll be advantage gamer be on the select screen going into the final game. And uh, will the clock be called on these guys again? They know they've been pushed hard. It's been a grueling match. I think they're understandably taking as much time as they can. And he is going to do it. Gamer B, known for his Adon. That is who he has basically pioneered in the course of Street Fighter 4. He's gonna try to put it all on the line with this character. He's going home or he's marching to grand finals. What'll it be? Up against Infiltration and his seemingly endless character options, all of them played at masterful levels. And I like that he's not releasing the fireball every time. He's choosing the shots, trying to keep Gamer B guessing a little bit, and Gamer B playing a very conservative game so far. 
Wow. Nice counter. Oh, pick. and a beautiful jump back to punish that Jaguar kick. Oh. He's got a lot of position with the fireball, but manages to recover. Holding him, he wants to hold him at exactly that range outside of the standing roundhouse range, which is a really important button for Gamer V here. Yep, safe on block when distance correctly. And look at that! Knows that Gamer V is playing a very slow defensive game. Just goes up for the dash throw. And yes, crouching under the fireball opens you up for the overhead, like just like that. Well, here comes Gamer V. He must survive this. Wow, oh. super smart EX pinwheel and just wants out of the corner. Dive to each to other. Down. Oh, he's gonna get the play. Infiltration now at max points. Everything is on the line here for Gamer B. Can Infiltration pull this off? And Gamer B looked like he didn't quite find his footing. Is he also just drained? Is he just out of gas in the tank? Does he have what it's gonna take? Can he look deep inside to get across this goal line? Poking back and forth. Good block on the overhead, wow. Oh, there he is, he's in now. Great block. Ba yeah, back dashes, tries to bait something out. Ooh, wow, brave the bold answer. Yeah. yeah. He's oh. threatening like he's gonna dive kick out of the corner, but then he didn't, and he got Gamer B to overcommit just a little bit. Oh, wow, infiltration, not hitting a button. Oh, the from front. the front! So tricky. Again, yes, finds the block and a good oh, tag. Wow. Staying alive. Again, back dash after his okay. oh. Okay, next could be a big punish. Yes, gets there. Oh, yeah, another stand on the house. But he finds his target. Here he comes. Oh, but right. just goes for the uppercut. Gamer B is going to take it to the last round of game five again. I don't know if I can take this, James. How many times have we said this? Game five, last round, Ultra Street Fighter four. <laughs> Dancing. Trying to find that, the approach. Wants to be in that stand roundhouse range, but also willing to sit back at the Jaguar kick range Ooh. as a threat. Ooh. There it is. Get the Finds juggle, it and the yeah. juggle. Now with the corner pressure. Yeah, Gamer B is trying to be, be very wary of that EX pinwheel that could turn the tides around very quickly. And I like the advantage for Gamer B here because he's playing a very simple game. He's only forced to think about a small number of things. If Infiltration continues to sit back like that, he needs to mix it up. He needs to get in Gamer B's head. Or Gamer B is playing with such confidence, he's able oh, to poke that correctly. so far! His entire game revolving now around that move and standing roundhouse. Looking for an uppercut if the jump comes. Oh, wow! Oh, here it comes! He the must guess properly it. here. Danger time! Good block oh. on the overhead. And now he's just gonna get out of there. Oh, trying to counter. Smart stuff. The Feng Shui engine pretty much neutralized. Infiltration knows it. Doesn't he want to overcommit. All back. Yes. He's gonna hang back and get it done in an honest way if he's gonna get it done at all. Ooh. Oh! Tried to punish it with a great jump back, but a little out of range. The advantage of that EX Jaguar is very quick. Looking for the follow-up. He's made a slight dent, but the time is running out. Keep your eye on the clock. 15 seconds. Ooh. Oh! Closing it in. Can Gamer B get it done? Now he's the, oh! Another, another roundhouse. Round. He's denying her. He's denying. He oh, can't come in. Uppercuts and then the throw. But only Will there be enough left. time? Two seconds left. He wants a timer. Scam it. Oh, oh the foul oh, in the oh, It's not, not enough. enough. The timer scam works. And Gamer B advances forward. One of the most mentally draining matches of Street Fighter I have ever witnessed on a competitive stage at this level.